Hello everybody and welcome to the Sovereign Village Project. I'm going to start a series today called the $500 Barn and we're going to try to do just that. We're going to try to build a barn for under $500. It's going to be very small because our situation is such that we just need something to store our rabbits, ducks, chickens in, a place to start our seeds and to put our basic tools. We don't need a lot of space so it's going to be closer to the, to the shed size um, but it's going to kind of ramble out into animal housing and a greenhouse. And we're going to use as much native materials as we can, as much from the land as we can, and only buy what we ha absolutely have to. We'll also be using a lot of recycled materials that we pulled from our other properties. So to start off, I looked around at what I had, and I decided the fastest thing that I could get off the ground right away would be cedar poles. Um, unlike cordwood, which would have to age a while, or log, um, this is something I can just start right away and buy a few materials to speed the process up. But we have these excellent, beautiful cedar trees growing with very straight poles at least a few of them on the outer edges, and they actually have to go to open up light for the garden anyway, so it's really a perfect spot to take a couple of down and use them elsewhere. And so what we're going to do is we're going to be stripping the bark off of them, which is very straightforward. All you need basically is a knife of just about any kind. You loosen it up, and then you can pull the bark off of it. And that will pre preserve the life of the cedar for a long time. As you can see, there's a lot of red in this stump. And that means that this is going to be an excellent tree for us. So we're just going to simply harvest four of these trees. We'll cut them to about uh, 12 to 14 foot lengths and we'll sink them into the ground and we'll build the shed off of that like a pole barn. And then we'll kind of do similar styles for the greenhouse and uh, I'll draw it all out on Sketchpad and make a video about that as we go. But again, I'm just using whatever is around me and I think I can pull it off for $500. We'll see. But stay tuned. In the meantime, happy homesteading. Everybody stay safe and be well.